What's up guys, Andy here from the Learn How Group. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use the Repost app. Here at LearnHow, we're creating video lessons and tutorials to help people learn how to use technology to improve their lifestyle. If you like what you see in this video, please consider subscribing. In this video, we're gonna be talking about the Repost app. This is a popular app that works in conjunction with Instagram if you want to repost pictures that you see on Instagram to your own Instagram profile. Please keep in mind though, that it's always best practice to make sure beforehand that you have permission to use other people's images. But for the most part, a lot of people who have public profiles, meaning that their Instagram profile is set to public and not private, a lot of those people won't mind if you use their images, if you just send them a message and ask them, and if you give them credit when you repost their image. So you can tag their Instagram handle or Instagram profile in the image, and then you can put a link to their Instagram profile in the description below your image. So let's see how to do that right now. All right, I'm gonna open up the repost app on my iPhone, and you'll see here that it's really basic. So on my repost app, all you can really see are some reposts, some old reposts that I did in the past for some other channels, and then the most recent repost that I did. All right, guys, to repost an image, we're gonna open Instagram, and we're gonna find the image that we want to repost. So I'm here on iSetups, looking at some uh, Apple pictures. So right here, if this is the image that I wanted to repost to my account, I would click the three dots up in the right corner, and then I would click copy link. Now you can only do this with public profiles, like I mentioned. So if this Instagram account I set up was a private account, we wouldn't be able to do this. But you're gonna click copy link, and then you're gonna go back and you're gonna open repost. And you'll see right here that the image shows up in repost. So now what I can do is I can click on the image and I can choose if I want to put a little repost shout out on the image. If you get the free version of repost, you're gonna be required to show the repost icon in one of the corners. If you get the paid version of the repost app, you'll have the option to use this where it doesn't show the name of the account on the image. After you choose which type of repost icon you're gonna put on your, on your image, you're gonna click repost, then click got it, and then when this pops up, you're gonna click copy to Instagram. This is gonna open up Instagram and it's gonna allow you to edit that photo as a new post. So I'm gonna post this to my feed and you can crop the photo if you need to. I'll just click next. You can put on a filter if you want. I'm gonna click next. Now is what you can do is you can copy the caption from the original photo. It was copied and then I'll just click right here in the caption space and click paste. So by default, it's gonna put in that little hashtag repost, and it's gonna put the caption that came with that original photo. So you can add in some extra text if you want. Uh, let's see, love this Apple setup, and then click okay and share. All right, now you can see that picture that we got from another Instagram account is right there in our account. We've got the little caption right there, the little description. We've got the shout out to who the original owners of the images were. And yeah, so a lot of accounts do that to repost popular images. You'll see Instagram accounts out there that will post quotes. They'll repost cool images of like what we did, Apple computers, cars, all sorts of things. So if you have an Instagram account or you're thinking of doing an Instagram business account that you wanna repost user images, I did one for a phishing account that I did and I'd repost uh, pictures of people who, who caught fish and posted it on Instagram. Uh, there's a lot of different ways that you can use the repost app. And I'm throwing a link in the description below this video that will take you to the app store to get the repost app. And like I mentioned, there's a free version 
or you can pay to unlock the full version. It's just a one-time a one-time fee, and that'll allow you to get rid of the little repost icon that will appear in, in one of the corners of the image. You can post the image with no pictures on it at all. All right, guys, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our future videos, and make sure you check out some of our other app videos and other video tutorials we have on our YouTube channel and over on our website, learnhowgroup.com. We'll see you guys next time.